Alright, folks, it's Pitching Ace 88. We're playing Criminal Case on Facebook, case number 28. We just realized that the wife killed her husband because he lied about uh, not watching their kid who ended up dying. Let's go to the additional investigation. Congratulations on a job well done, Captain Ace. I'd like to close this case, but apparently Miss Littlewood encountered a problem at Elm Manor. She was helping to clean it up so it could be sold, and she found something she wants you to see. Sir, sorry to interrupt, but I'd like to know if people can go back into the greenhouse again. I'm here on my club's behalf. You know, I'm an active member of the Orchids Fanatics Club, and... All right, Nathan, once we're done in the greenhouse, your club can meet there again. Now, I believe you all have work to do. Hey, Ace, you should come to our next meeting. That way you can check up on Charles afterwards, because he seemed devastated after the trial. Well, that's a good idea, and... Wait a second, is that Father Von Pratt? I wonder why he came to the station. Let's talk to him, Ace. Surprising! We have three people that we need to check up on. I'm so shocked. Not. Anyways, hello, Captain Ace. Hello, Nathan. How are your orchids? How did your orchids fanatics club meeting go? My flowers are perfectly healthy. And actually, I bought Captain a brought Captain Ace with me for an introduction to the beauty of orchids. They've got quite the green thumb, just as I guessed. Anyway, I heard what happened during the investigation. How are you holding up? The woman I loved turned into a cold-blooded murderer. That was quite shocking. I really loved Gloria. I loved the woman she was, but that tragic accident changed her more than I could comprehend. So I thought I would do something to distract myself from those depressing thoughts. I wanted to breed a new carnivorous flower, a beautiful but deadly one, like Gloria turned out to be. But I'm so un un unfocused, I lost, even lost the pollen I needed. I stored it in a vial and put it somewhere around here. Please, Captain Ace, can you help me? I really need it. Uh-huh. All right. I wonder if he's going to be in the in the end game. Captain Ace, thank goodness you're here. I was afraid you wouldn't have time to come help me. Of course we came, Margaret. It's our duty to help the citizens. We heard you have something to show us. What's the problem? Well, I was helping Camilla to clean the house. You know, it's going to be sold. Hopefully Camilla will be able to buy it back. That poor woman couldn't handle other strangers in her family's house. Well, anyways, I was about to clean the hall. The place is such a mess. My, my help was really needed, but my lovely Astrid started suddenly started to bark. She was sniffing around a pot and seemed determined to open it. I know my girl. She has a good nose. And instantly, I knew something was wrong with this pot. When I opened it, it was filled with white powder. I'm scared. After all that happened with the Fernandez family, I wouldn't be surprised if it was drugs. I left the pot in the manor and called immediately. You have to take a look. Alright. Definitely looks like cocaine, but we'll definitely take a look for you. What's up, father? Ah, Captain Ace, it's a good thing you're here. I need some help. After what happened with Hector and your investigation, I reflect upon my actions. I was wrong. I deceived my parish and didn't leave it up to my title as a priest. But I wish to make amends, and I'll put the money I got from the innocent people to good use. I'm planning a charity fair in, dedication, in our dedicated scout's honor with a big raffle. All the money I have will go into it, and all the money given will go to our scout's association. But the beautiful kite I wanted to raffle off vanish. I misplaced it somewhere in the chapel. Please, Captain Ace, it's the raffle's best prize. Can you help me find it? Heck yeah. Seems like definitely a job for Ace. Detective. But as you guys can tell, I basically got all the stars that I need, so this is just going to be a waiting around to finish off everything. Anywho, where's the vial? Alright, let's do this. Uh, tin can. Powder pot. Oh, this is a tin can. Um, crap. Uh, shoot, we got glass. Match is... Oh, crap. I forget this. Wow, it's been a while. Uh, snake is here. Billiard balls. I thought it was here. No? Oh, it's up here. Forgot. Blood is here. Shamrock. Wow, I failed you guys miserably on this. I know the flowers down there. Um, screwdriver, and I have no idea where the and the music box. Wow, wow, that was bad. I'm normally a lot better than that. Margaret was right. The powder in that pot looks like a drug. I wonder what it's doing in this manner. I hope it's not something dangerous. Come on, Ace, let's take a powder sample from this pot for Grace. All right. keep going through. Alright, now this is the one where we're looking for a kite. Let's see. I don't see the kite. I will find it, though, eventually. So, there we go. A, mask. Oh, the cot. 
the kite's broken. Hair, parrot, seashell, noose, mustache, flower, fabric pieces, and the halo. There you go. Booyah! This colorful fabric seems rather out of place in a church. People seem to forget all kinds of stuff here, but I bet it's Father Von Pratt's kite. If it's a raffle stop prize, we can't leave it like this. Let's honor your reputation and repair it, Ace. I really like how they do that. It's kind of fun. You know how you like, you know, I can repair anything? Alright. Ooh, two! This is fantastic. And yet, I still don't do as well, but I still do pretty good. Here we go. This powder sample will soon tell us what's inside the pot. Looks like this house still has stories to tell. Let's t take this to the lab. Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, three hours. I like three hours. Three hours is really nice. Let's go to the greenhouse. Oh, there's the flowers. But, okay, pile of dirt. Yep, uh, plain tongue is here. Watering can. I forgot. Oh, there it is. Pumpkin, northern star, apple, sun, bamboo, dead leaf, and beetle. There we go. I, I didn't do that the quickest, but it's not horrible. I didn't realize how fun searching scenes could be. I love this place, and digging in through it was fascinating. What made you notice this pile of dirt in particular, Ace? Do you think the pollen vial Charles lost is in it? Well, I'll let you search through it then. Looks very cool. <laughs> like seeing him in his, uh, like, casual clothes. Okay, this shouldn't take that long, actually. Alright, well, that, there's definitely the vial in it. There we go. Fantastic! Alright, amazing. This is the vial Charles needs for his breeding. How did he manage to drop his precious pollen in this vial of dirt? We should give it back to him. I know how good gardening is to relieve stress, and the man needs a good distraction. Do you think he could teach me to breed a new kind of orchid, too? I bet you he could. I bet you he's that talented. He seems amazing. He also seems like he could be a murderer at some point. I'm just going to throw that out there. Alright, so... I've actually flown a kite before, so I should be able to get this kind of uh, made. Yeah, there we go. There we go, there we go. There we go. Perfect. Nice. Love it. Wonderful. I bet the, the kid who will get this kite at the raffle will be very happy. You did a great job at repairing it, Ace. Let's give it back to Father Von Pratt. It's a good thing he decided to redeem himself. The community was shaken if he was exposed as a fraud. Yeah, I've never heard of a, of a religious person being a fraud. My pollen vial. Thank you, Captain Ace. Thanks to you, my new flower will be perfect. Beautiful. Tremendous. It'll be my masterpiece. You already look better, Charles. I'm glad this breeding project is cheering you up. Thanks to you, this greenhouse is an amazing place. And nobody gives as good gardening advice as you. My orchids look healthier every time I bring them here. Of course, as long as I take, take, can take care of my plants, I can get over anything, even this drama with Gloria. Thank you again, Ace. The breeding will take some time, but come see my new carnivorous plant someday. Oh, snap. Give me a lot of Give me a lot of experience. I like it. Alright. What's up, Father Von Prott? Father Von Prott, here's the kite you lost. Captain Ace found it. Broken. So you might want to keep an eye on the children who come in here broken but you repair so nicely ace thank you so much with this kite as a prize i'm sure the charity fair will be very successful if i still have money from my shameful frauds afterwards i'll use it to create a coral for the church it should have a positive impact on the community would you be interested in joining the choir captain ace i'm sure the costumes i created will suit you perfectly please you have to at least try them on angel okay wow okay no i'm not wearing those i'm sorry i'm sorry that's not happening but anyways, guys, I will see you guys in three hours. This has been Pitching Ace 88, over and out. All right, let's figure out what this sample is. So Grace, what can you tell us about this powder we found in this pot from El Manor? You're gonna be surprised, but this powder isn't a drug. I don't think there are a lot of drug dealers in the historical district anyways. 
powder you found is just baby milk powder. Totally harmless, although judging by the smell and its color, it's clearly gone off. Baby milk powder? No wonder Asher went crazy over it. That dog is so used to its master's cooking, I bet it can find food anywhere. Let's tell this to Margaret, she'll be relieved. Yes, she will, and I'll be super relieved because we're going to be going on to case number 29 very soon. Oh, what? Anyways, we're back, Margaret, and we have good news. The powder Astrid found in the house isn't a drug. I'm so glad to hear this, Ace. Can you imagine drugs in my own neighbor's house? That would have been so scary. But what was this powder, then? Well, it's just baby milk powder. Our expert confirmed it was old. The Fernandes probably forgot about it after the death of their dramatic... After the dramatic death of their boy. It became quite smelly. That's why Astrid noticed it. Really? My Astra is so talented. She'll win every medal po possible at the dog show pageant. I'm so excited. Well, no offense, but she'd probably just want to eat the pout. She's so talented and beautiful. Oh, my darling, you're going to win for mommy, right? Thank you, Captain Ace. Take this. I was in such a state. I just had to cook to relax. Oh, you know what I think, actually? I think the last case of this area is actually going to be the murder of a dog. I think that's what it's going to be. It's not going to be a purse. It's going to be a dog. But anyways, guys, stay tuned for the next case of 29. We've got a couple more cases left before we're done with the historical district. I'll see you guys all later. This has been Pitching Ace 88, over and out.